Christine Brown's wild wedding lap dance sparks outrage. Fans cringe at Sister Wives star's bold move. Exclusive details on the controversial moment and intimate wedding revelations. Christine Gone Wild Sister Wives Christine Brown gives husband David a lap dance leaving fans suffering secondhand embarrassment. What Christine had to say about the awkward moment and more details on the couple's special day Christine Brown has given fans secondhand embarrassment after sharing an intimate moment with her new husband. Christine and David Woolley's wedding TV special titled Sister Wives, Christine and David's wedding aired its finale on Sunday night. Part 2 featured both the ceremony and reception, which was full of both fun and emotional moments. Toward the end of the night, a chair was brought into the middle of the dance floor as David was instructed to sit. Jared, a man David considers to be like a son, proceeded to give him a lap dance as attendees stood in a circle around them. Following the hilarious moment, Christine said Jared gestured to her that it was her turn. The Sister Wives star went on to straddle her new husband, rubbing her hands along his chest as he grabbed onto her butt. In a confessional during the special's airing, Christine noted how she looked over at her former sister wife, Janelle Brown, who looked shocked at the moment. While the moment may have been inappropriate, especially after realizing her children and mother were watching her, Christine went on to say that she didn't care. It was hard to believe she was raised so religious for so many years, David's daughter and son-in-law joked during a confessional. I think they kind of forgot people were there they added. Too awkward to handle. Over on Reddit, some viewers felt the moment was too inappropriate for their wedding guests. Anyone uncomfortable at Christine's dance, one person wrote, adding, sorry when you make your guest uncomfortable it's inappropriate. I had the worst secondhand embarrassment for her. I think she'd had a little bit too much to drink to make a good judgment call, by that point, a second agreed. OMG I had the same thought watching the wedding. She's finally sewing, sick, her wild oats in her fifties, a third said. I agree Christine is awkward, but I love seeing her happy, a fourth mentioned. Janelle, her kids and me, thought it was odd, said a fifth. I like Christine but I had to fast forward through that part because of secondhand embarrassment, another replied. Wedding Details Christine and David tied the knot in October at Red Cliffs Lodge, a magical hotel in Moab, Utah, after getting engaged in April. The newlyweds originally met on a dating app a year before their October wedding. An insider told the U.S. Sun that the outdoor wedding was an all-day affair with setup beginning in the early hours of the morning and guests arriving in the early afternoon. For the ceremony, Christine's son, Paydon, walked her halfway down the aisle, with her dad taking over after. Forgoing traditional bridesmaids and groomsmen, Christine and David opted to have their combined 16 grandchildren walk down the aisle as well. For the ceremony, it was just the couple and their officiant. The couple exchanged vows on a wooden stage where all their friends and family witnessed the unforgettable moment. The insider noted that there were over 300 people who attended the wedding. We felt loved the whole day. I didn't just feel loved by David. It was by everybody, all of our guests. It was an incredible experience. The wedding was everything I hoped for. It was romantic and fun and exciting. And it was beautiful. Just a magical day. Although Christine's ex Cody Brown wasn't invited to the big day, he was part of the wedding special, appearing in a filmed interview with his last standing wife Robin. After 26 years of plural marriage, welcoming six children, Christine and the polygamist announced their divorce in November 2021. Today's Next News Ariella Brown's Rude Behavior Learned from Robin Recently, a topic came up for Sister Wives fans that has them wondering if Robin Brown's daughter Ariella Brown is learning rude behavior from her mom. Undoubtedly, most kids pick up some traits from their parents, the good and the bad. But fans are appalled by the way Ariella is acting. Robin and Cody Brown get criticism for how they parent Ariella Brown. 
In the past, Robin and Cody Brown have been criticized for their parenting of Ariella Brown. While she is the youngest child of the Brown family, many people believe she is getting a very lazy parenting style from Robin and Cody. When she started kindergarten, Cody admitted she had never had to wake up that early before. Additionally, people scoff at an unmanaged bedtime for Ariella Brown. Often she is said to stay up past midnight and occasionally all night. But the harshest backlash has been for the use of a pacifier at six years old. Unquestionably, this is an odd habit for most kids that age. However, now fans notice a rude behavior that seems to be directly learned from Robin. Fans notice a rude behavior Ariella Brown mimics. On Reddit, a user starts a thread about Ariella Brown, saying, like mother like daughter. Then attaches a photo of Robin grabbing Cody's face to get his attention. Then next to that picture is an image of Ariella holding her brother Solomon's face similarly. Following, other fans give their thoughts on the action Ariella mimics. This is such a pet peeve of mine. I feel like someone else putting their hands on your face, so they can get a point across to you, is crossing a boundary. It's just like people who playfully have bat other people in the face. Instantly fills me with rage. Not for Cody, he is so whipped. Loser. It must be something she does constantly, if the kids are picking up in her behaviors. Pretty gross, even if it is Cody and he needs to shut up. Right? If this only happened the times we saw on camera her children wouldn't have learned the behavior but she must do it often enough that they see it as a normal thing to do. Wow, never put these two together before. It must be a common occurrence. I wonder if she does it to the kids too. My guess is yes. My husband would have had to take a time out. Grabbing someone's face is very demeaning. Other fans weigh in. Afterward, other Sister Wives fans gave their thoughts on Reddit about Ariella Brown and other family members as well. I thought the same thing about these two scenes. The older daughters are constantly crying and playing victim just like Robin as well. Sadly their household is probably very toxic and unhealthy. Yep. All her daughters have unhealthy learned behaviors from their mom. More and more it amazes me how much he sticks by her. She seems like his bully. Oh, ick. Nothing like passing on your least likable behaviors and traits to the next generation. I hope Soul doesn't grow up to abandon women and children like his loser father. They really need to teach her to stop this behavior. One day she'll pull this stunt on a kid who will find the behavior very threatening. And they will reflexively strike back. She's lucky soul is a chill kid. Other kids take physical contact as an act of aggression. What do you think about Ariella Brown grabbing Solomon's face like Robin does Cody? Do you think it is an acceptable behavior? Are you hoping for Sister Wives Season 19? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. We'd love to hear what you think. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.